my channel. So today I am going to be doing the what's in my purse tag and I thought this would be a really really good idea. I know I do have another one that I already did. I think I did it about maybe a year ago and so I kind of wanted to do an updated one because before you know I was going to work full time now I don't. So if you guys want to keep watching I do suggest you stick around. But before that, please be sure to subscribe to my channel, give me a like, and I think we're ready to get into this video. Okay, you guys, so first off, I do want to talk about the purse itself. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys, was sent to me. And so this company, Teddy Blake, Teddy Blake is the name of the company, and they reached out to me. And they were like, hey, what do you think if you can, you know, review this for us? And I was like, sure, why not? So I always t tell you guys, though, that I'll be completely honest with you. And, yeah, this is what I tell the companies as well. I tell them that I'm going to be completely honest. And um, the ones that do have confidence in their items or whatever the case might be, um, they go ahead and send them anyways. So they did um, let me choose my bag. And, of course, if you guys know me, you know that I love the color pink. And, of course, I got the color pink. They have a variety of them, but I just felt like this one was perfect for me. One thing that I really, really, really loved about the purse was the gold accents. So, if you guys didn't know, I love gold. I love gold on everything. Gold just complements my skin tone. I am more of an olive skin tone, so um, gold just looks pretty on, prettier on me. Of course, I do like silver. It's just um, I lean more towards uh, gold things, so... Yeah, of course I have to have it in gold and the style of this purse is the Eva, Eva and then it's 13 inches and I got it in pink. They do have other um, sizes and other sizes and colors so um, you have a variety to choose from. So what I really was shocked about when I first received this purse was the quality, you guys. The way it feels, I don't know if you guys can tell. But it's just a very thick purse and it just feels very, very, very high end because it is. I believe this purse retails at $439 or $479 if I'm not mistaken. I'll leave everything, uh, all the information about the purse down below. But so I think the brand is Beauty, Beauty um, brand. It's just maybe like that's the name of the design designer is Teddy Blake. And so these are manufactured and handmade, I believe. In Italy, it comes with a little certificate, and it says that it's made in Italy. I don't know if you guys can see that. So it says it's made in Italy, so I even keep it on because I think it's so cute. When I do wear it out, I just tuck it into, like, the purse. But for, like, when I have it on display, I like to have it out just to, like, look cool or whatever. So inside of the purse, um, I really like this little design that it has. So you just kind of go like this and go like this. That's how you open it. So inside of my purse, first thing you see is, since this purse does have, which I really, really like, is, um, what is this called? It's suede. But it's, it's real suede, you guys. So it's really pretty. I don't know if you guys can see. I don't think you guys can see. But I'll insert some pictures of what the inside looks like, or if not, then I'll link down below the um, like the information of the actual like website and the purse details. But so first thing you see when you look into my purse are business cards. So as many of you know, I do have a business, and um, of course I like to carry around all of my business cards. Oh, yeah. There. I like to carry around a lot of business, well, a handful of business cards just so that I can have them handy and just in case, you know, I see a potential customer. So next thing you see is my little bag. This little baggie, I got it at, I got it at Victoria's Secret. It came with like a pack of like four. Basically in here, I like to keep all of my, like, you know, the menstrual cycle stuff, all of the hygiene um, for down there, um, I like to keep these little wipes. These are really, really good. Um, they keep me fresh sometimes if, like, you know when you're on your period, you feel, like, dirty or something. Then, um, it's just to, like, freshen up and stuff. So, I like to keep that in here. And the other little pocket that I have next to, because it has, my purse has two pockets. Um, and the other little pocket, I like to carry, like, my cards, which is 
I should really get a wallet, but I just throw shit in there because sometimes I'll just like run really fast to the store and I don't even like carry a purse. So basically I just keep my debit card. I keep my, well, this is my Ulta card. I don't even go that often, but I, I went the other day, so I had it in here. Um, I like to keep at least $20 cash always on me, you guys, because even though I know I have money in my card, I always have that like feeling like, oh my God, what if it declines? And then like, what am I going to do? That's embarrassing, you know? So I always carry a, at least like either 10 to 20 bucks, but I carry some, some type of cash always for emergencies because I get scared, you know, that's so embarrassing. Okay, next thing you see is my emergency um, little bag for makeup. I don't really like to carry my makeup because I don't. Well, I do retouch it. I, don't, I just don't wear makeup that often anymore, but I am going to start to. So when I do, like on the weekends when we, we go out as a family, I do like to take my little bag to like retouch and things like that. So um, one thing that I do take is whatever lip gloss I'm wearing that day, I'll take it with me. Right now they're a little bit dirty. That's why I keep a bag inside of a bag because this is how they get. And I'll just take whatever lip gloss, lipstick that I'm wearing that day. I'll also take some makeup removing wipes. And these are nice because sometimes, you know how your lips get really cr crusty really quickly? Especially when you're wearing like, um, like matte lipsticks. They get really, they can just build up really quickly. So I like to remove the entire lipstick and then reapply it. I also like to carry an additional highlighter. Um, this highlighter, I don't really use it except for like when it's like emergencies. And this is why I keep it here. But I keep it here just because like, um, just in case one day I forget or I lose my other one or something like that. I always have it here just in case. I for sure carry my um, compact because my compact, in case, you know, I accidentally wipe a little bit more than I should have of my lipstick or something, I'll just go in and retouch with a little bit of powder and then I'm good. I also like to use a mirror in this, so, you know, it works. Um, and then lastly, I also like to carry some tweezers. Tweezers are really important for many, many things, you guys. Sometimes your eyelash will be bugging you and you have to, like, remove your um, additional eyelash, the one that's bugging you. So I like to carry these for anything. Like, they even work for, like, your eyebrow. Maybe you see an extra hair, a little bigote hair, a nose hair, anything. Like, tweezers are one thing that I totally recommend for you guys to always carry. And that's what it is in here. This is like the basics of what I carry because I don't like to carry like my entire bag because I used to do that and no. Especially since they stole from me. Remember I told you guys that they barely stole my makeup. So now I'm really cautious about the things that I carry just in case I get shit stolen from me again. It won't be that much, you know, money worth. Okay, so then the next thing I carry is this lotion. And this lotion, a lot of you have heard me talk about this. So this is the Honest Company Honest Face Body Lotion. And this lotion, you guys, um, is for my son basically. But um, lately our hands have been getting, well, my hands have been getting really, really dry. And um, we just, I always have to be moisturizing because I'll feel it. Like, they'll feel really stretchy. when You know when you stretch out something? And then it just goes back in. That's how they feel all the time. It just feels really, really ugly. So I always carry this, especially for him now, to, um, he needs it. So I like to carry this just in case. This is very, very good, um, for his skin. He has kind of like, he hasn't been diagnosed with, with eczema, but he has, he just gets really, really bad, um, like a little allergic reactions like when it comes to like the places where he sweats the most like around here his neck um like under his knee in the back of his knees he just sweats like crazy so this helps him a lot the thing else that i carry is um uh, deodorant and yeah i always just this is my favorite deodorant actually so i was able to find it in mini size and i always just carry it because i I have a thing for like smelling I don't want to smell ever so I always just try to like stay fresh if I feel like oh my god maybe I forgot to you know put on deodorant and always just put it on the car really quickly before I get off anywhere so yeah I always carry this and this is important for so many reasons you guys you guys do not want to go into a restaurant smelling 
nasty so something else that I like to have in here is um, hand sanitizer and I like to have it here for many reasons for my son for myself sometimes we eat a snack or something on the go and we don't have a chance to get off wash our hands in the restroom or something um, and hand sanitizer always comes through and I like to have this one it, it's just regular hand sanitizer it's like the naturals but yeah, we have these around the house everywhere too because sometimes my son will be a little lazy to wash his hands. So we tell him to at least like do the hand sanitizing thing. Well, next thing I have in here are wet ones. And these are important just for everything. Like if you want to wipe off the cart, if you want to wipe off something that you're about to grab at the store or something. Come through. Um, they're really important to have. So I do carry this chapstick again. It's I am a mom, so a lot of the things that I carry are for my son. And I'm being completely honest, this bag is not just filled with stuff that um, benefits me. It's also for my son. So um, I don't have he's older, so I don't have a diaper bag or anything like that. So it's always easier for me to just throw whatever he's gonna need in here, just so I could only carry one bag. So I like to use this for his lips. I also, of course, I carry my phone on in my inside of my purse and as you can see it's pink I love pink it's my favorite color last but not least I always carry this with me um this is the lock and it's a strap for the purse maybe I can put it on for you guys I never put it on because I think it looks so cute and so like classy like this like when I carry it like this um I've never like had um to put this on but let me show you guys the way it looks so this is the way the purse would look with the straps, which is also so pretty. So basically, if you're going like to the hood or something and you're like, oh shit, um, like I'm not trying to get robbed, me, which I should always have this on because, you know, I already got robbed once. So I want to put on the little lock, which also looks so cute. And now you have a lock to it and you can always just carry this like your keychain or something I would say you know hang it over here but what's the point of you hanging it here if you're not trying to get robbed right like this is like so dumb so always just like you can always keep it like on the side your little cajoncito or something um but yeah you guys I think that's gonna be it I hope you guys enjoyed this little um what's in my purse i hope you guys can go ahead and check out teddy blake very very nice very very chic and classy purse i hope you guys enjoyed this video um please don't forget to give me a like subscribe to my channel and yeah i think i'll talk to you guys next time thank you bye bye Ya entendimos todas las señales Hoy voy a hacerte hasta lo que no sabes Porque yo sé que tú prefieres tocar a lo que puedes ver Así que vente pa' la oscuridad